Uh, so the next and final riff I'm gonna show you is the chorus of clarity. Uh, this one's uh, challenging because there's some odd time signatures kind of sprinkled out through it, but uh, I'll do my best to kind of remember what's going on here. It's a mixture of kind of these, these suspended chords right here, followed by some arpeggios that follow. So it kind of... All right, so it's kind of a mixture of a rhythm and lead. Whenever you see me do these stretch chords here, some people would refer to those as ninths, but they are suspended second chords. Again, that's a really cool way to just kind of add some flavor to kind of a stock progression is, is throwing in some of those seconds in there to make it more tense and a bit more interesting. Now, uh, the second half here is a, is a challenging bit, and I would say it's economy picked. So what, what economy picking is, is it's kind of like a mixture of sweeping and alternate picking. So basically, I'm picking in the direction of the string that I'm going to next. So I start here on an upstroke. Pardon that little bit of slot, but you can kind of get the idea that it's not straight sweep picking because you'll see my hand alternate picking, but let's say I'm moving in a downward position, moving down from like, let's say the G to the B string, that'll be a downstroke no matter what, just so I can smoothly change strings. And the same thing will happen as I'm doing anything uh, with an upstroke going to another string higher. I'll lead with an upstroke so that I don't have to necessarily go over the string. It goes right through it and makes for a very economic range of motion. For this last one, I'm going to play the economy picking section at 75% speed because the first half is in a weird time signature and it's hard to do. <laughs>